Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on whitecloak.oplegends.com and the prison server has just released a few minutes ago. We have just bought some credits and I'm going to be doing a 1000 credit giveaway. So if you guys do want to go ahead and enter, make sure to join my IP whitecloak.oplegends.com and also make sure to comment your IGN and like the video because that is going to enter the giveaway for the 1000 credits. And we're going to be starting off and hopefully we can make a ton of progress in this video. We, we have already voted. The Let's go ahead and claim the keys and we have a vote party create we have a vote party cake that we did get let's go ahead and open it up click to open hopefully we can get something good to help us start off and let's see it looks like we have an auto activating or booster some more old boosters some money boosters and what is this a tier one power search ultimate modifier doubles all of your pickaxe modifiers for 40 seconds modifier cooldown eight minutes that is actually really cool it is an ultimate multiplier let's go ahead and claim it this looks like it was applied to our pickaxe if we take a look in, in here because it's click to activate okay definitely going to take that that is going to be very very helpful when we do get some modifiers but let's go ahead and do slash crates open up the 10 crate keys hopefully we see what we can get it looks like it's just a ton of boosters pass points proc rate boosters definitely going to take those and now let's just go straight to the mine because we want to get started as soon as possible and try to get ahead of everybody currently we just this is our first time mining on the server we are gonna have to expand our backpack real quick let's see how many orbs we have 300 how much does it take to upgrade capacity 500 okay we're gonna have to mine for a little bit uh i don't think so law matters right now the big thing that we're gonna try to do is probably get some enchants we have all of these enchants and it's honestly gonna be such a fun time to grind them all let's do slash show all real quick boom it gives us what does it give us it gives us money it looks like pretty sure money is probably used to rank up or prestige or something like that so it's gonna be very very useful and we're gonna do a lot of giveaways in the next few videos so stay tuned for those it's gonna be very very fun and as you can see we are getting the drop lemonite in this is basically armor so if we take a look in slash armor we can actually buy lemonite armor and this will basically give us a boost to the money and beacons that we get there's also sapphire jade ruby sir zircon and obsidian but those require raw blocks and those are just from you get from mining and as you get to 1 million you'll be able to unlock the new set we have a few orbs now let's go ahead and upgrade the capacity because it is kind of getting a little annoying having to keep doing slash sell all so we upgraded it a little bit it can hold almost 5,000 blocks definitely gonna take that not too bad Looks like the vote party was activated. There is about says 700 players on the server, so that's honestly insane. But let's go ahead and put down the crate, or maybe we can't put it there. I think we have to open it up at spawn. Let's go to slash spawn to open it. Let's see. Open it up. Hopefully, we can get some orbs. I honestly don't know what the rewards you can get from these are. But I mean, we're definitely going to take boosters because boosters are going to help us a ton. Was that 500,000 beacons, or is that even mine? I don't think that's mine. Oh, no, it was. We did get 500,000 beacons. Definitely going to take that. I don't know what else we got. It doesn't really look like we got anything, but definitely going to take those 500,000 beacons. I'm pretty sure. I don't really know you can use beacons for but i know the beacons are very useful for something if we come to spawn and take a look at the mailman over here we're gonna go ahead and claim the first reward that is 32 regular pet boxes uh i think we should probably get a pet backpack i don't really know how probably from the crates um yeah probably from the crates so we're gonna have to try to look out for that there's also an afk area for over there that we're probably gonna go when we do afk but we don't have any crate keys from now on that means we're gonna have to probably get the key finder enchant requires rebirth level one okay that's gonna take a little bit to actually go ahead and get let's see what you need rebirth level one it says we need pickaxe level 100 and we need only 6400 orbs so that's not too hard to get the pickaxe levels is what's gonna be challenging but i mean yeah we're still level zero so so you can see it's going to take a little bit for us to get to level 100. But we can do slash rank up. And from these skills, we did get 50,000 blocks of orbs. And those are basically just the orbs currency. If we take a look in slash skills, we can go ahead. Let's go into the mining skills. We actually can get some rewards. So the next thing we get is 16 loot crate keys. This is auto claimed rewards. We get money boosters, orbs, and it goes all the way to, let's see, level 30, start of the world key and money scroll. So yeah, as you see, leveling up your skills are going to be very, very good for some good rewards. So we have 50,000 creds from crates. Let's see what enchants we go ahead and get. We don't have any orb greed. Okay. We need rebirth level one. That is going to take quite a bit, actually. Oh, it wasn't rebirth level. It was actually pickaxe level, and we do have that. So let's go ahead. Let's see how much we could put. We could put only four levels. Okay, that's going to take a while to actually max out, but we do have the first level, so we, so we should be getting a lot more orbs now, hopefully. And orbs are also tradable, so you can trade orbs for other items on the server, and that's really, really cool because it is a new feature they brought back this season. It's just going to help the economy out and stuff. Now we're going to go ahead and open up the pet box because 
because these pets are can give us some boost like this tier one orb pet gives us a one percent or just a one booster towards orbs which is really good so let's just open up all of them some of them are going to be common pets and you can't combine those so just do the command slash delete beginner pets and it should delete them and actually we have a decent amount right here that we can go ahead and ascend and that basically just combines them so let's go pet ascension quick ascend let's claim all of them let me just delete the beginner pets again and let's see if we could put any more in looks like a tier three or pet that is actually really good for now definitely gonna take that let's go ahead looks like we don't have pv do we have inner chest no so we're gonna go ahead and equip the what is it the tier three orb pet and this is gonna help us get more orbs which is gonna be really good we also have 800,000 orbs i honestly don't know from what but it's gonna help us get some enchants let's go ahead and put i think orb greed is honestly the best enchant we should be maxing out right now we can get the dragon burst enchant at level two and then scavenger chance of finding efficiency and more fortune so yeah we shouldn't be going for efficiency or fortune right now because once we get scavenger it will automatically find those for us explosive chance of causing an explosion which breaks many blocks that could be good but i think orb greed is the best because it's going to allow us to get even more orbs from mining if we take a look and do slash mine there's all of these different things but we want to go ahead and take a look at the mine upgrades and this is going to allow us if we take a look it's only a level four out of 100 but this basically after we break enough blocks it will level up and increase the mine radius and beacon rate and those are really good because increasing the mine radius will just allow us to get more blocks from some enchants and the beacons are really really useful on the server so those are going to be good too and the spawn rate will help us get more of them i think i'm going to go ahead and put some enchants or guess about the enchants of the explosive because with the explosive enchants it will just allow us to get more blocks which can be very useful we have 18 rank ups available let's do it and we should be at rank 50 and then we should probably be able to get a rank mouse okay yeah we did the max amount of rank up so we're at rank 50 now if we take a look and slash milestones that means we got a uh, just the orb booster but definitely gonna take it still because definitely gonna help us get some more orbs i'm honestly just gonna keep mining it's probably the best thing you do when you do start off i'm pretty sure they i'm pretty sure they did a key all let's take a look in the slash mailbox um boom do slash mailbox we have all of these boat crates and stuff i don't even know we just so much stuff in here let's do slash claim all claim all of the keys 50 relic keys okay those are gonna be insane 14 vote party crates let's just open up all of them so okay this is a good spot let's just put all of them down it says too many players are opening crates in this world maybe go to another area okay i'm at my plot hopefully we can put some down here okay it looks like we can so let's go ahead and put all of them down let's go ahead and open up with them there's so many um boom 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 or left it's like we can't put any more down oh my gosh there's so many we're gonna get a ton of boosters probably i should probably put some chests down too for some storage what is this a global money booster okay this is gonna be helpful for the whole server because it is a global money booster and it is a forex so that is really good we have 25 million uh orbs i just realized that is pretty crazy it's gonna help us a ton let's go ahead claim the last four of them and see if we get anything else that is good probably some more orbs would be pretty helpful i'm pretty sure i saw some right there yeah 35 and global orb booster that is really really good too i'm gonna place some chests down for some storage go to my mine and probably upgrade my pickaxe a little bit okay so it looks like we have 35 million orbs to go ahead and spend on our pickaxe we are level three we do let's see this one requires let's see which one let's see what enchants we could go up to until we need a rebirth so it looks like till key finder is when we actually need a rebirth so we go up to speed speed um i don't know if we really need it if we're gonna be flying around while mining haste swing your arm faster that could be useful it's only one level so it shouldn't be too crazy and then okay so what do we what can we even get dragon burst we can get it, it looks like we can get 1k of that let's see how much orb greed we could get 600 levels of orb greed orb greed that might be pretty good let's go ahead and put let's go ahead and put 250 levels on orb greed and the rest on uh dragon burst because dragon burst has a chance of mining a whole layer which is honestly really really good as you can see it just procced and it mines a whole layer which is really good we leveled up and got a orb booster so let's go ahead and claim it it's gonna give us some extra orbs and i'm just gonna continue to keep mining we are just really trying to just get some more orbs and we could probably rank up a lot let's do slash rank up max when we're at rank 68 not bad at all once we do get orb greed to a pretty high level we should be getting a lot of orbs because we're at 200k right now which is all right we could definitely be getting a lot more like those crates gave us 35 million and it'll probably take us a while to get the 35 million by regularly mining i mean we could definitely get there but it may take a little because our orb greed is only level 300 out of 1250 once we rebirth it will actually increase the max level which is a really cool feature on the server but we do have some rank up so let's do slash rank up max that is a command to automatically rank up and that did get us to level 100 which is going to give us a loot finder booster um i don't really know if that's good loot finder it seems to probably just find loot in the ground we did get 16 loot crate keys though auto 
claimed rewards. So let's say we've got some orbs, some pet boxes, and some rank ups. Let's go and claim the pets. They're both beginner pets. Let's just get rid of them. Not really useful. Um, I forgot to open up the crate keys from the vote party. So let's go ahead and open up the mine keys. Looks like we got a bunch of orbs and a pet box. Open up the pet box. Tier the orb pet. Okay, that's gonna be good. Once we get another one, or yeah, once we get another one, I think we can combine all of them and get a tier four. Let's open up the next crate key, which is loot crate so boom probably some more orbs yeah more orbs and pet boxes basically what we're going to be getting from all the crates and now let's open up the 114 relic crates these are going to help us a ton from those relic crates it looks like we got robots robots you can use in slash warp afk and i just opened up all of them but they generate looks like modifiers crates boosters all that stuff that is very very useful we also got a bunch of pet boxes we got all of these regular pet boxes and two ultra pet boxes but we also got a medium pet backpack and it's going to help us a ton because this this is going to allow us to hold on to the pets and automatically ascend them and delete the bad pets we also got two tier 3 modifier boxes let's open up both of them looks like we got a 0.16 x beacon boost and a another 0.16 beacon boost so let's just put one of those on and let's just store all the rest of this stuff that we don't really need but i'm gonna go ahead and open up the pet boxes because those are gonna help us i'm done opening all of them up and it looks like we got two tier 4 supply drops from that one tier 1 proc rate pet that is probably really good Oh, uh, we got a tier 4 money pet looks like and a tier 4 orb pet we're definitely going to use the orb pet we do need orbs a lot so we're going to claim that we also have player shops not very useful for, for us right now we could go ahead and set it up for some crate keys or something in the future but probably not right now and this is we're ranked 414 which is really really crazy let's go to the, let's go to the mine but we do have 4 million orbs so let's go ahead and put those into orb greed looks like it will level up a little bit but it's honestly really, really expensive for orb greed for us right now but we're going to keep getting there hopefully Hopefully it will get a lot easier in the future as we do get orb greed and get a lot more orbs we did get a relic from mining this is a common relic and you can go ahead and put it into the incubator npc over there basically these could give you six regular pet boxes or six relic crates so not the best but it is only the common rarity i don't know if it's working right now but those real those would be really good if you do get a higher tier of them but we have 33 rank ups available let's do slash rank up max and we're at 447 so that is really really good we are also trying to get the lemonite armor and this we need 750 gems to craft to craft each piece since we only have 95 so we do have a long way to go but we are going to continue to keep grinding and getting them and since orbs are now tradable that should make leveling up our pickaxe or getting better enchants a lot faster because we could trade stuff for orbs and pretty sure when you rebirth and i'm pretty sure when you rebirth you don't lose the progress you've made on your enchants but you just get an increased level that you can max it out to so that is really fun and also every 1000 or 1000 or so raw blocks mind is about one level so it's going to take us quite a bit to get to level 100 to rebirth when you're just starting out you should keep resetting your mind because in slash mine because in slash mine you can go ahead and do the upgrades and right now i'm at 10 out of the 100 i'm pretty sure i was at 4 out of 100 earlier so our mind is bigger and you have to reset it to increase the size once it does increase there's also bosses on the server and i'm not sure how to get them but they are really really cool you mine blocks to defeat it i'm pretty sure the top five people actually get rewards so it's honestly really cool let's go ahead and do the rank ups because i'm pretty sure there is a milestone at rank 450 so let's do rank up max at this point we should just be maxing out the orb greed so we're gonna go ahead and put some more levels onto it and once we get a decent amount of orbs we're just gonna keep putting some enchants levels on orb greed because that is gonna help us out the most and i'm gonna go ahead and put auto sell or some enchants of auto sell onto my backpack because it's kind of annoying to having to keep doing slash sell all so two levels should might be kind of slow but it should auto sell every now and then then the goal for today's episode is to get to level 500 because that would be that would be pretty cool our pickaxe is now level 15 which means we can go ahead and buy all the enchants that we can for our current rebirth uh let's go ahead so haste swing your arm faster i don't know if that even affects anything but we have scavenger here let's go ahead and apply 300 thousand orbs on it because that is going to give us efficiency and fortune which are both pretty good enchants fortune will be good because it will give us more blocks which means more money and money is good for ranking up and stuff we are actually able to get to level 500 like that fi level 516 we're at well i think that's gonna be it for today's episode we did get our pickaxe to level 19 with almost 20 000 raw blocks mined we're at about rank 536 which is pretty decent but yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. Don't forget to join the giveaway for a thousand credits and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.